Let's keep going up the Belarusian tower segment. Now, is that guy back? Yes, he is. I mean, we're not gonna, we're not gonna deal with him if I can. Is this a door? No. I mean, it's a door. It's adorable, honestly. Uh, but we're just gonna go by everybody. Bye, everybody. Hi, Dr. Nick. Man, I hope Dr. Nick's doing okay. The fuck, brother? Well, if it isn't the blowjob, brothers. How are you alive? Oh, now you're not. Blowjob brothers represent. Shout out. Beyond the veil, beyond the pale, the rat cousin's here to say, hey, 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 hey. Do not dare burn me. The bird tries to burn. It's a bird burn. I got a weird feeling that we're actually pretty close to a side of grace. So let me see if I can avoid being killed by this. And avoid drowning at the same time. Okay. Uh, that got me good. S sister, that got me good. Okay, he's backing off. We'll go this way for now. He backed off. He's too big. He's too big. This... this this city is not handicap accessible enough for him. Which means we're safe. Look at him, he's just looking. Hey dude, eat poison. Hey dude, I'm a rat. I'm not be I'm not above cheese. Ah! <laughs> Stupid! Stupid is as stupid does, motherfucker. Hmm? He tossed me around. He tossed me around like I'm nothing but a ragdoll. The cat's looking at me. There's gotta be maybe a quicker run. I don't care enough about my runes to, uh... to go that way, because I might try going the other way left after the pot woman's tunnel to see if we can find a side of grace. Like, I, I don't I don't mind losing them enough at this point. I would rather make the progress than go hunting them. Jesus! Get off my ass! He's got that... He's got a slow build-up for that shit. Oh. Papa. Jesus. Good timing, cousin. Oh, bad timing. Bad timing. Ah. What the frickin'... No, I didn't even pick it up. I didn't even pick it up. Okay, we gotta kill him. He's getting too much in our way. Let's try to butcher knife him. Let's try to butcher knife him. I love I love I love when you know what's coming, you just run past them. 
when you're not looking for the items anymore. And they just miss you, they're just whiffing on your ass. <laughs> it's fun, it's cute, it's quaint. It's petite. Oh, maybe we should go this way? Since we did lose all our runes, maybe there's like a shortcut right there? More spiders? Let's see where the shortcut goes. We have so much shit to do in this little dungeon. Ah, uh, and this is the big gate, isn't it? Papa was a rolling stone. Wherever he laid his hat, he would bone. No, we got a shorty. We got the Miyazaki loop unlocked. And sometimes that's what you do. Sometimes you gotta dissect the fingerlings. Sometimes you gotta dissect the fingerlings. You're talking about Renala, and I think we pretty... We know that we fight, uh... We actually fight Renala's sister. You knew that. Don't play stupid, PC Hockey Boy. We fight Rolana. She's Renala. We fight Rolana. I know that from people talking about the previews. Oh my god, there's two of them. Bone bow. Ooh, that sounds cool. Is this one even bigger? Ooh, we just got good bleed on it. Hello, Scarpy Marpy. You've been satisfied by me. We should read about the bone bow. If we're gonna prone bone, the bone bone. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Am I missing anything? Okay. Bone me. A crude short bow fashioned from sickly bone. A medium for spirit calling? Huh. I bet it's like, is it intelligence pilled? What is it? No, just dex and strength, and you could shoot little rancor shots with it. Little, little death nonsense. Interesting. My sickly pale bone, bo bow bone, bow burnum bone, bone burnum. I did not watch. I know it's a millennial rite of passage at this point, but I did not watch his stuck inside COVID thing. Because I want to go there. Let's go here. We've got the shortcut. Let's go here first. Dude, I do love our two-handed butcher knife style. It is a fun way to go. Hmm. Rail, rail flesh mushroom. He was puking maggots on us. We want to live in the grind because we're interested in bleed and we're interested in poison because we're interested in status effects. And fly mold for when we make hefty fly pots. I remember this? You guys remember this? This is the side where we killed them from, remember? And it's all come clear. How'd you know? I just knew. I just knew that's where those guys were. I just had a visual map in my head. I could forget my family's birthdays, but I will know. <laughs> Visually in my head, I will get the diagram going. Bokey Boon. This is a really solid dungeon, I would say, so far. I'm really digging it. Slime crime. Grime time. You know what we need to do? We need to listen to the slime crime song. What was it called? Fuck, I don't know where it is. Never mind, I don't know where it is. I don't know where it is. 
And this is where we died the other time. Yeah, y'all y'all fall down there and just be girlfriend and boyfriend down there. Okay, so this is where the big guy is. See? Miyazaki looped again. Though I'm worried because I don't see the big guy. What am I, Tony Stark talking about the Hulk? I do have Stormcaller with this, which is going to be good right here because there's like... Oh, remember when we died here? We didn't have any souls on us. Why oh, so many revered spirit ashes? Do they get powered up by their being bleed in the area as well? <laughs> okay. Well, we know where our shortcut is. So let's go back to uh Billarad Tower celibate. We got we have so many places to go here to unlock items. So when we reach the boss, I think we then we backtrack and we go like, okay, the well and that other door. Unless we should be backtracking there now, I don't know. Is it safer to go the way through the the flies? I think I think the flyway is the safe way. God, this is a I like this. I like this dungeon a lot. Flyway's the safe way. Let's go. Ooh, also we missed some shit. What am I blind? What am I blind all of a sudden? No, I don't think we can get up there yet. But we could probably drop down there from where we're going, so we should keep that in mind. So it looks like there's an item. An item who is a friend of mine. What the? That's a good Ash of War. Thank you. You have to not play this till your nephew gets back from a festival because you're going to co op the whole thing? You should do that seamless co op mod unless you're not on PC. Okay. It's weird, because ever since we came from this angle, I have not seen this guy. Oh, he's over there, that's why. But that's good. Like, this angle avoids that fucking piece of shit. It's, it's interesting that our big butcher knife isn't necessarily our most damage, but it could stun lock a bunch of little bitches. Okay, let's, let's kill these. Get out of my life. Killed. Killed him. Okay, can I reach that place I was talking about? Is it through here? No. Uh. You thought this was half of a scissor? <laughs> Is this where? No, it isn't. It's right over there. How do we get over there? You guys see what I mean? Like, there, there's a... We have to, there's a way to get to there, and I don't know what it is. I'm also interested in seeing if this does good stunnies on this guy. Doesn't seem like it does. So maybe we don't do him. Maybe we don't do him.
that's guy. That's the kind of guy who seems like better to take care of ranged or something if you can. I'm excited because my my main PS5 character I'm going to be playing this with is a spellcaster. Like it has some bleed, but it's mostly like flame damage and frenzied flame stuff. And I don't know. I think that's going to be fun because it's going to play so differently. That's where the spiders were. Yeah, I wonder how we get to there. You could probably get that sword for him, yeah, but I, it probably doesn't really work well with our stat spread. Maybe it does, but I don't think it does. Also, Rat because it's more into his butcher knives and his claws. You gotta go around the other side. I gotta go around the other side. That's He grabs you if you go around this side. Feels like Starshy Kit wants to play this game, but she wants to play it as a strength user. <laughs> That's what it feels like, honestly, from all the weapons you like. She's like, hey, good for you. That's that's not it's not a criticism at all. That is a lots of people play as strength users. It it might be quality, it might be strength and dex, but we're we're going arcane, so we're looking for Shit that procs, like I said, status effects, bleed, poison. Is this a secret I see? No, it's just a bullshit. This is one of the heaviest swords right here. Or axes, I guess it's technically a great axe, but once they have one of the heavier weapons that is... Uh, that scales mostly on dexterity innately. Ah, is this above the spiders? Oh shit, I got killed. <coughs> so this is above the spiders. I'm learning. You watch Barbarous King play with two giant chicken wings? Sounds fun. Wait a minute. Was that a steak of America? Okay, nice. Guess we found a steak of America. Oh, probably because of this fucker. These guys are tough, man. These guys are fast. And tough. And they're so, like, swirly that it's kind of hard to figure out, like, what they're going to do. Oh, but our R1s pog them. Okay, I just need to R1 them. Just remember that. Just remember your R1s pog him. The R1s pog him. I bet we're getting close to one ending of this level, which means I'm going to double back at a certain point. God damn it, I matter. Oh, we could summon that guy. Or, or, no, that's that lady who said she could fight for us. So this is definitely a boss. I would like to explore this level a little more, though. So we're going to go back to... Uh, small pirate's altar. They never call me the Mad Ratter. They just call me... Hello, Korean. Late for dinner. Look at let's go. <laughs> okay, I think we've got two keys to use. I should summon aid uh, Eldor. We'll probably do the summon, honestly. It's our first time through. Like, why not? It's it's narrative. I don't know. Maybe not maybe not the first fight, maybe a second time, I don't know. Okay, where's the bridge? Is this the bridge? Oh, the bridge is upstairs. I didn't need to go back this way. Stupid stinker boy. Stinker rat man. So let's try to open this door first. There's still literally, remember, there's that area I don't know how to get to yet. You hear that? There's some weird heavy breathing. 
Does that mean an NPC, though? Because if it's dialogue... Yeah, it looks like... Holy shit, who the fuck are you? The fuck? What the fuck? She's attractive and is the size of an average human mother. <sighs> who are thou, stranger? Uh, an omen. By the look of thee, another of Nesmer's peons, me six. No. These old bones fascinate thee yet. Our lands were by thy kind set aflame. Our tower by thy kind veiled in shadow. Thou camest, robbing us of all. Man, Mesmer and his forces really ruined this place. Have ye not basked in these deeds long enough? Listen, progeny of the wanton's trumpet. Progeny of the wanton's trumpet? Wanton. The sacred beast shall unleash its ire. Till then, with this old hag, do what thou wilt. For all the good, it'll do thee in the end. Well, I'm not with Mesmer, so I'm not fucking with you, lady. For what reason dost thou falter, villain? What, you think I should kill you? Thy sordid work with fullest pride. Dude, she's Wanton from Dark Place. If Wanton gets a word of this... For good, you gotta drop the strumpet shit. Be gone. These lands were ours since times of old. Be gone. These lands were ours. Get a lady. I ain't no rotten strumpet. She gotta drop the rotten strumpet talk. Honestly, quite rude and uncouth. It's honestly quite uncouth. Okay, what do we do here? Is we've been downstairs. D -d 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 downstairs. Are we supposed to jump across there? Uh, that's weird. It's quite uncouth, Dad. I don't like what that lady's saying. To say that about my father is weird. That's a very strange... Like, we used a key to get in there. We just talked to that NPC. I've got a feeling I've heard... Because we can attack here, right? I've got a feeling killing her might help with the boss fight from what I've heard. Because it kind of reminds me of the Demon Souls puppet people. You, you remember there's the, there's the idol, the fool's idol or whatever? I don't see what going there does, but I just... I really don't see what going out here does at all. Am I crazy? Do you guys have any idea? You could jump out there, but there's nowhere else to go after that. Yeah. Huh. Strange little roundabout. Maybe there's a way to go from that roof to go in there or something. I don't know. Well, let's go to the well. More exploring to do. Did you say something about PETA? PETA Griffin, our new favorite weapon? Speaking of... PETA! <laughs> no, but I'm pretty sure I've heard it's some of the people talk about the preview that... Maybe I'm misremembering, but I'm pretty sure I've heard that if you kill her, it helps with the boss fight. But I feel like I don't want to. I mean, she seems angry and seems to be begging for you to kill her. And I, and she has the mask that I'm pretty sure is from the boss that's in that area, which is like the weird Chinese dragon mask. Like, I saw that in that room. IDK. I bet this is what our key is for, right? Yep. That was the dry well key. Whole new area to explore. Mesmer fire grease me. Let's find out what is in the piss-soaked sewer where the rats belong. The hell? What is this? Outside of 
Irithyll the Boreal Valley, or whatever. Oh, it's a poison swamp. Well done, Miyazaki. <laughs> You've done it again. When the, when the pissed shit festers, we got poison swamp tactic. Okay, let's look around, though. Let's get a vantage, because we could definitely go that way. There's so many places to go. God, these games are fucking great. They're like, an obvious linear progression? No. Just go places. <laughs> Find different nooks and crannies. It's more like, just like a twisting nebula of branches, much like the Erd tree itself. Oh, I'm still poisoned. Nope, I'm not poisoned. It's, dra it's draining. Wait, can't we use soap? Do I have any soap? I feel like I've, I haven't used the soap once, ever, in this game. Do I even have any? I might not have any. Or the wool's cloth or something like that? Nah. Oh, wait, there it was. No. I would use the, uh, the the curing boluses or whatever, but I, I don't think I got the recipe for poison cure in this character. Uh, okay, let's... Let's find out where we go. Cotton Eye Joe. Let's find out where we go. Where did we come from? And I don't even say that as a joke. Now I'm like, where the fuck did we come from? Oh... An undulating tree serpent! We just... fought one of these, or is this different? What the hell? We could kill this. Give me a steak, America. Damn it. We can kill this. We could kill that. What's the fastest way to the well? Through the roofs? Probably through the roofs. Oh, wait, here's a part of the roofs we haven't been to, y'all. <laughs> New roof tech just unlocked. So in the end, a good thing we died. Oh, speaking of. Had a death. Add another death because I was busy adding a death. What do you hate, Pustu? The undulating tree serpents or whatever? I think that's what that was, but like a weird poisoned one. New roof just unlocked. Let myself die just getting shot at by wind boys. And we lost all our souls. No, no big deal, but we did. <laughs> run, 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 run. Banana phone. Uh-oh. Okay, ladders are for there to, for you to climb down. To climb down. No, you didn't, bitch. We'll get it this time. Uh, in fact, you know what? If we're fighting the undulating tree serpent, it's probably immune to poison because it's green. But I think if we crag blade and jump attack it and stun and bleed, we'll we'll do well. So I'm not too worried. Kind of wanted to dodge that, but hey. Hey, video game, I kind of wanted to dodge that. But no, do what you want. It's just, I keep thinking it's going to be down a further corridor. We'll keep, like the last two times. I have thought, like, oh shoot, that's probably down a further corridor. Turns out, not down a third further corridor. Be cool if we could ride our horse here. Quick, quick, smish, 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 smish. Little horsey, smish, 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 smish. Come over here, little horsey, smish, 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 little horsey. We got him. We got him. As soon as we hear the rumbling, we crag it. Hello, Korean. The 
Come on. Oh, shit. Jumpy. Jumpy. Heal me. Jumpy, heal me. There's a bleed. Knock him down. And then just go fucking to town. Go fuck him in town. And we should be able to get another bleed and kill him, right? Oh, shit. We didn't get another bleed yet. That attack is, like, the scariest, but is also, like, the easiest to dodge. Oh, shit. Heal me. There we go. His bleed was building up. We got him. I told y'all we got him. Immunizing Horn Charm plus two? Let's check this shit out. Vastly raises immunity, which I think is the resistance to poison. So let's... Let, we're we're going to put it on, but... Immunity governs resistance poison. Right, yeah. Hordes are sublime artifacts to horn scent, and their presence confirms the belief that they're chosen people. Only the repeated sprouting of fresh hordes can create tangled horn, which is viewed as an irrefutable symbol of whatever it's called. Uh, let's put it on. Because we happen to be in a poisonous area. Just because we happen to be. That, that's a good little talisman to get. I, I, in fact, now I don't mind uh, using this. Look how slow that poison be building. Worth it. That item's worth it. Look how green our footprints are. The rat and footies green. <laughs> he's not in hoodie green. He's in footies green now, dude. The pajamas got unlocked. Safe to heal me? In the sunken poison depths of the forgotten citadel, Rat Cousin brings his mind. Whoa, whoa, jumping on gargoyles, bro. Speaking of gargoyles by Disney, we just jumped on gargoyles. Item. Ooh, thank you for the neutralizers. Thank you, thank you. Uh oh. Flyman's courage. The flyman's crouch. You know what I want more than the arcane right now is successive attacks report restore HP. I think that would be fun to have. Uh, I want to go up to there. The rat and footies green. There's so many flymans. Let's get them. Lure them with arrows. Lure them with fire arrows, even though we should probably save them. Okay. Keeping us living. I want to go over here, see if we've missed any items. I hope this is engaging, guys. This is how I, I play this game. This is how I play it. This is how I roll. I hope we get the Beast Claw soon. I would love to get a Beast Claw before we end the night. I don't know where any of them are. We've only got one new weapon type. There, it's, it's crazy how many new... I wouldn't expect this many new talismans to be in this game. I heard there's, like, a lot, which is crazy. To me, that's like seems like... I don't know. It's just kind of wild. I mean, it's great. I love having a lot of weird passive options and choosing which one you want. You're engaged? I'm glad, Pustu. Listen, we only really struggled with one boss, but we're about to probably be on a very hard boss. <laughs> That's why I'm kind of searching around for stuff first. But maybe not. Maybe we're going to kick its ass. I don't know. But we do have the summon, and I don't feel bad using it because the summons are in there for a reason. And uh, it's narrative, and it's a lady we talk to. <laughs> Me in real life. I would like to summon you. Why are you just sliding, it, sliding into my DMs, rat cousin? I would like to summon you, for you are a woman I have talked to. Thank you, daddy.
Oh shit. Oh shit. You know, that would have been a good moment for Stormcaller. That, that's... I wonder if I could put Stormcrawler on my fists. I, I really like that just quick AoE. Also, it applies the status effects you're doing. It's really nice. I, I should probably duplicate that. Ooh, there's a big boy there. There's a big boy. Mighty shot. What the hell? I want to poison him. Damn it, he got us. Heal me. Heal me and live. Heal me and live. Shit. Shit, there's so many of you. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, get off. Stop locking on. Stop locking on and run. Beast liver? I hardly knew her. Heal me? God, that was the time to attack, too. Oh, shit. Okay, he's... He's not poisoned yet. But you know what I'm gonna do? You, you knew it. You knew it, y'all. Got him. Horned warrior sword. Ooh. Okay, get out, because they're they're throwing shit our way. We got, we got, we got it. I also need to go... You know what I need to do off-stream at some point is go... I think the one of the best great runes to activate, if we ever want to do that, is uh, Radon's, because I think it just gives you like a big health and stamina upgrade. And I haven't gone to his tower and figured that out, so <laughs> I should go do that. What the heck? Where are all these flies coming from? Flies of pee? Hold up. Serpent arrows for our serpent bow. You shouldn't skip karaoke. You can always watch the VOD tomorrow, dude. Don't let don't let this interrupt your life. You keep forgetting because you never activate the new runes. Poisoned hand. Hold up. Did we just get a poisoned martial arts weapon? Are we about to be the poison ninja? Hold up. Okay, let's look at the shit we've picked up that's new. First of all, the Horned Warrior Sword. We don't have enough faith for it. Curved Sword of the Horned Warriors. Oh, it's this weapon. The one that uh, Starshine loved. You never get Night Rat, dude? Yeah, but this recording exists forever. Like, it's going to be on YouTube pretty soon. It's going to be on Twitch for a while. You should go live your real life, if you can. The Ornamental... But if you don't want to, that's fine, too. I, I don't. I often stay inside. Ornamental tangled horns allow the blade to serve as a medium for horn calling. Invokes tangled horns. That's what we saw. Interesting. Now let's see this. Poisoned hand. A glove stitched together from the flayed skin of the victims of a butcherous bloodbath. Afflicts target with deadly poison, of course. Raises attack power when poisoning occurs in the facility. Okay, hold up. That's great. Because that we already have something that does that. So we could double that with the with the talisman. Forge of an unyielding black impulse towards revenge fostered of those who have had everything burned. So the people here are so fucking killed and sad, their vengeance and hatred lives on, as we saw in the old lady. Poison spear hand strikes the unique skill, makes hand in the shape of a spear before releasing a plunging stab that penetrates the body of the enemy. See arcane scaling. Requires 28 arcane. Poison buildup. I mean, let's finish exploring here, but we're upgrading the shit out of that. Holy fuck. Our first fun weapon for us. We should go up that ladder and see where it goes, because it probably loops around. There's still an item I'm looking to figure out how to get, though. We'll think about that. That one that was in the area above the flies in the gutter punk. 
Mysterio. Damn. We're not even going to use the fist until we warp back and upgrade it. I'm very excited. The only thing that would make it better is if it were Rat Claws. Because even though we are high decks, I just don't see us like as a martial artist. I see us more as like a... Just a nasty boy. Oh! And this is the elevator? No, but it is close to it, right? Where is this? Where is this? Because I reckon... Like, I remember the door that was like, you can't go through here. Oh, yeah, it's right here. Wait, did you get a cool sword? Yeah, I got the sword. I, I got the sword that I think you said you thought was cool. Where is it? I, it's too much. It, it costs too much faith for us to use. But here it is. It's not as big on us. Oh, hold up. It it gets dual wielded. That's pretty cool. It's cool because it does physical damage. Like this would actually be good on my uh, my PlayStation character because look, we do like no damage on it. Uh, because it does physical damage, and uh, so it can be buffed by a spell uh, that I have. Like you can't buff weapons. Like like for instance. When we've infused... Like, if something does poison damage, which which this doesn't, but, like, for instance, this has the blood infusion. You can't put, like, resin or grease on it. You can put, um... Or cast, like, a spell buff or anything, because you've infused it with something that's elemental, in this case, blood, but it could be fire or ice or whatever. So, that being a faith-based weapon that gets dual-wielded inherently when you press R1 instead of two-handing a big one. So that's the thing. It's kind of like the claws. Like, instead of, like, you pressing R triangle and R1 and you're two hold handing it with two holds, handing it, holding it with two hands, uh, <laughs> it, it, you grab two of them, which is good because it attacks a lot, and my character has the Blood Flame Blade incantation buff, which puts blood fire on the weapon, so it infuses it with more fire damage and bleeding, and it's putting it on two versions of it. I don't know, just I, I might use it. I might use it on my other guy. These are zombies. Let's go for it. We have a lot of zombies right now. I don't know if I'm going to max it out. Like, oh, we need a somber smithing stone nine. I don't know if we're going to max it out because I kind of like want to see all the weapons that exist before we max out. Before we spend our highest level of shit. Hey, no problem. Sorry for... I hope everyone enjoyed me nerding out. It's interesting because I feel like if this channel grows bigger and we play Souls games, I feel like a large section of the chat will just know what's happening already. But it's interesting talking to people who might not know. Luguru, what have you done? You've scared yourself. Oh, snap. So I mean, I'm pretty sure that means... Yeah, we cannot... Uh... Give me Stormcaller. Oh no, I don't want to duplicate Stormcaller. We can't use that on the fist. But yeah, this is... We can't put bleeding on this. So this is like only a poison build if we do it this way. Which means... Oh, but we're not even using the bleed one right now anyway. Well, guys, you guys want to check out our new weapon? And let's, let's look for... Let's look for the way... To where we need to go to find that item. I want to find that item. There's a little area we haven't been, but first, let's take a look at our new weapon. We're punching. We're just punching. We're just we're just poison punching, man. And what's well, let's see what the L2 looks like. That's sick, and it poisons the fuck out of him. And we're getting a double buff. Ooh. Eat it. The rat cousin's here. The rat cousin is here. 480 is our D. But when the buffs go away, it's like down to... Like our, our, our damage... Are we buffed anymore? 
372. So we should see how high it is when we buff. It's kind of fun. The martial arts are fun. It's just punching shit. It's just legitimately punching things. I bet I took off the wrong talisman earlier, because I didn't have blood talisman on. Oh, this looks like a secret. This might be leading to where I need to go. And blood talisman, I think, is what I wanted to leave on for fighting the tree spirit, because I assumed he couldn't get poisoned. We might need to learn how to do R2s, baby. We might need to learn how to do R2s. Okay, they're coming down. Ooh. Whoa, that's actually kind of sick with just with the, the whole ground pound shit. I did not expect. I was like, I hope there's a poison beast claw weapon, and I still hope that. Oh, we found a secret one of the things. But I didn't expect it just to be a martial art with a infested fist. Look at it's the mother of the flymen. Mother toilet. The mother toilet didn't like that. Dude, I'm so glad we found this because then we could upgrade ourselves one more time. And ladies and gentlemen, this is, is this where I said I needed to go? Yep, this is exactly where I said I needed to go. Papa's so smart. I found it by accident. Dried bouquet, another fucking talisman. Raise attack power when summon spirit dies, huh? The sorrow that flows from the untimely demise of a loved one is a tenderness shared by all. <laughs> we all share this tenderness. Okay, guys. It's one of the things, says Sivart. What do you mean it's one of the things? What's your problem? What is your problem, and what are things? Okay, should we try to poison punch this guy to death? Oh boy, I'm scared. Cutscene alert. Cutscene alert. Oh, horn-decked beast from higher sphere delivered. Yeah, that's the old lady. Take root inside the tower sculpted keepers. And perched within, we beg of thee, rise. Oh, he rising. Mama, he's rising. Sebastian. Yeah, that is three kids in a trench coat trying to sneak into the movie theater to see Furiosa's theory, Mad Max Furiosa's saga. What the heck? We got a poison. Whoa. Uh. Okay. It's poisoned. Okay. Okay. Uh, but not impossible. That's what I'm getting from that. We got him poisoned pretty quickly. We could probably do bleed and do pretty well, too. Uh, that sounds good. That sounds good. And also, we didn't even use the Skadu Tree Fragment yet. <sighs> we need some more attempts. We're definitely beating this guy tonight. 